بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم آئی ہوپ یو آل آر فائن اینڈ اسٹنگ سیف اینڈ ہیپی ایٹ یور ہومس آئی ایم یو جی کے ٹیچر مس فرہین اینڈ آئی ویلکم یو آل ٹو یور جی کے کلاس مائی ڈیئر اسٹوڈنٹس ایز یو نو دیٹ وی آر آن یونٹ نمبر ٹویلو اینڈ دا نیم آف آر یونٹ از دا نیچرل انوائرمنٹ اینڈ ریسورسز ٹوڈے از اٹس ففتھ لیسن بٹ بفور اسٹارٹنگ دا لیسن لیٹس کوکلی ری کیپ واٹ وی ڈیڈ ان دا پریویس لیسن سو یو ہیو ٹو آنسر اے فیو کوشچنس کوکلی ٹیل می وائی از ایئر امپارٹنٹ فار آس ایز یو نو دیٹ ان دا پریویس لیسن وی ڈسکسڈ آل اباؤٹ ایئر ایز اے نیچرل ریسورسز وائی اٹ از امپارٹنٹ واٹ آر دا ڈفرینٹ گیسز پریزنٹ ان اٹ سو یو ہیو ٹو ٹیل می وائی از ایئر امپارٹنٹ فار آس because air helps us in breathing very good how would our life be without air agar hawa na ho to aapki zindagi kaisi ho jayegi you cannot live without air so life is not possible without air So my dear students, from here we will move forward as you know that we have discussed about different natural resources, we have discussed about sun, we have discussed about land, we have also discussed about water as a natural resource. Pani bohut important hota hai, iske bagair bhi zindagi jo hai wo mumkin nahi hai, life cannot uh, remain without water. And then we also discussed about air as a natural resource. تو اب ہم نے اتنے زیادہ نیچرل ریسورسز کے بارے میں پڑھ لیا ہے آج ہم پڑھیں گے مین میڈ اینڈ نیچرل ریسورسز میں کیا ڈفرینس ہے سو مائی ڈیئر اسٹوڈنٹس نیکسٹ آن یور اسکرین یو کین سی ہیئر آن ون سائڈ یو کین سی آل دا نیچرل تھنگس یو کین سی ماؤنٹینز یو کین سی ٹریز کلاؤڈس سن ایئر واٹر آل دیز تھنگس آر نیچرل ریسورسز ویئر ایز آن دا ادر سائڈ یو کین ٹیل کہ یہ جو ہیں یہ مین میڈ چیزیں ہیں بکس ٹیبل چیئر پینسل آن دا ٹیبل دین یو کین سی اے بیگ آن دا چیئر سو ناؤ کوکلی ٹیل می وچ سائڈ از نیچرل اینڈ وچ سائڈ از مین میڈ ہیئر یو کین سی دس از نیچرل آل دا تھنگز آر نیچرل ویئر ایز دس سائڈ از مین میڈ یہاں پہ بکس بھی آدمیوں نے بنائی ہیں اوبویسلی پیپل میک بکس ٹیبل پینسل bags and chairs so there's a difference between man-made and natural things okay from here we will move forward here you can see Sara is standing in her living room and Sara is thinking that she wants to eat chicken so can she eat chicken like this kya Sara is tarike se chicken ko kha sakti hai no so what she need to do here is Sara will cook it in the kitchen inside a pot theek hai to jab sara isko cook kar legi to natural things se chicken jo hai wo man made uh, food mein change ho jayega curry mein change ho jayega biryani mein change ho jayega anything that she wants so that means ki koi bhi jo hum man made cheez banate hain wo basically natural cheezon se hi milkar banti hai theek hai to hum ye bhi padhenge so my dear students here you can see کہ شوگر کین جو ہے گنے جو ہوتے ہیں دے آر نیچرل یہ نیچرل ہوتے ہیں سو دا شوگر دیٹ یو ایٹ اور یو پٹ ان سائڈ یور ٹی اور ان سائڈ اینی سویٹ تھنگ تو دیٹ شوگر کمز فرام دا شوگر کین یہ شوگر کین سے بنتی ہے سو دیٹ مینس کہ ہم اپنی ضرورتوں کے لیے ڈفرینٹ مین مین مٹیریلس جو ہم بناتے ہیں وہ ہم نیچرل چیزوں سے بناتے ہیں ٹو فلفل آور نیڈس So with this, we will move forward towards student learning outcomes, which are given on page number 85. So today we will differentiate between the natural and human made materials. We will see which are natural and which are human made materials. From here, we will move forward towards the Islamic perspective. As you all know that everything around us, the natural things are made by the God. Allah Ta'ala has made it. It is God who made the earth for you to settle and the heavens as a canopy. He designed you and perfected your design and provided you with wholesome things. Such is God your Lord. So blessed be God, Lord of the worlds. So we must be extremely thankful for all the blessings that we are enjoying in our daily life. From here, we will move forward towards some pre-reading questions that you need to answer. Quickly tell me the chair on which you are sitting right now, what it is made of. 
इट्स रिसोर्स इज रैट नेचुरल और मैन मेड अब जिस चेयर पे आप बैठे हुए हैं वट इट इज मेड ऑफ क्विकली टेल मी मे बी वुड सो टेल मी वुड इज मैन मेड और नेचुरल वुड इज नेचुरल ऑफ कोर्स बिकॉज इट कम्स फ्रॉम द ट्री एंड ट्री इज नेचुरल तो दैट मीन्स जिस चेयर पे आप बैठे हुए हैं वो एक नेचुरल चीज से बनी हुई है ठीक है एक नेचुरल चीज से हमने उसको बनाया है नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन लुक एट द डिफरेंट थिंग्स अराउंड यू एंड टेल वॉट आर दे मेड अप ऑफ एंड इज इट नेचुरल और मैन मेड ठीक है अब अपने इर्द गिर्द आप डिफरेंट चीजों को देखें लुक अराउंड पॉज द वीडियो एंड लुक अराउंड डिफरेंट थिंग्स अराउंड यू एंड देन टेल कि ये चीजें किस चीज से बनी हुई है एंड द थिंग इज नेचुरल और मैन मेड ठीक है फ्रॉम हेयर वी विल मूव फॉरवर्ड so around me i can see an lcd i can see a wooden table i can see uh, clothes which i am wearing so i can tell that all these things are somehow uh, made from the natural things the clothes that i am wearing they are made from cotton and cotton is a natural product and then the table uh, the wooden table is made from the wood the table is man made but the thing from which it is made up of that is natural wood is natural theek hai lekin jab isko insaan bana dete to then it becomes man made okay from here we will move forward quickly pause the video and pay open page number 90 in your gk2 books i hope everybody has open page number 90 in their books so my dear students Here on the screen you can see natural materials and man-made materials. Let's quickly have a look at the pictures first. So you can see that the wheat is natural and the bread is made from this wheat, but the bread is man-made. क्योंकि हम इसको बनाते हैं तो that means it's man-made. Plants are natural and the medicines are made up of प्लांट्स डिफरेंट मेडिसिन जो हैं वो प्लांट्स से बनती हैं तो दैट मीन्स मेडिसिन आर क्योंकि हमने इनको बनाया है तो दैट्स वाई दे आर मैन मेड बट द सोर्स इज नेचुरल वुड इज नेचुरल द फर्नीचर विच इज मेड फ्रॉम इट इज मैन मेड द एनिमल स्किन इज नेचुरल एंड द डिफरेंट प्रोडक्ट्स विच आर मेड फ्रॉम देम आर मैन मेड सिमिलरली कॉटन क्रॉप इज नेचुरल एंड द क्लोथ्स विच आर मेड फ्रॉम इट आर man made so from here we will move forward towards the reading page quickly uh, put your fingers where i will read natural and man made materials human beings always depend upon natural resources some of these resources could not be used in raw form so man has developed techniques that process the raw material and make different products below are given some examples so my dear students here you can see ke hum jo hai human beings jo hai hum different cheeze banate hain hum kapde banate hain tables banate hain chairs banate hain bags books pencils stationery products so these all things are called man made materials ये चीजें जो मैन मेड मटीरियल हैं ओरिजिनली दे कम फ्रॉम द नेचुरल मटीरियल्स और वो नेचुरल मटीरियल जो होते हैं वो रॉ फॉर्म में होते हैं अपनी ओरिजिनल फॉर्म में होते हैं तो हम उनको ओरिजिनल फॉर्म में रॉ फॉर्म में यूज नहीं कर सकते दैट्स वाई वी चेंज दैम एंड दे बिकम मैन मेड ओके हम बहुत सी टेक्निक्स यूज करते हैं बहुत से डिफरेंट मशीनरीज यूज करते हैं टू चेंज दैम इन टू अ चेयर अ टेबल एन एल सी डी a whiteboard a blackboard so this is how we change different natural things into man made things so below you can see different pictures jinko hum already dekh chuke hain let me zoom them in again for you okay so here you can see different natural materials and man made materials on your screen okay my dear students this side is all raw materials this is all raw materials these are all man made materials okay raw means natural or in their original form 
From here, we will move forward towards your practice page. So you have to open page number 94 in your books. And you also have to open your, take out your pencils. Okay. So reading. Exercise B, identify different man-made products from the following and name their natural resource. I will do the first one for you and you will do the rest by yourself. So here you can see jam. This is jam and you have to tell this is jam or aapko iska natural resource batana hai. So it is mixed fruit jam, so its natural resource is fruits. Okay, so aapko tamam man-made cheezo ko batana hai. This is natural. So you will write here natural. Okay, again this is man-made. These are biscuits. So, um, what is its resource? Wheat. Then chair is again man-made. And what is its resource? Wood. Uh, so now we will move forward towards the next page. Okay. Here you can see coal. Coal is natural. Then sugar is man-made. And what is its resource? I told you in the start of the lesson. Sugar cane. Very nice. Okay. Then plant. A plant is also natural. You will write here natural. Then a sweater. It is man-made. And what is its resource? Quickly tell me. Wool. And wool comes from animals. Okay. So my dear students, here we have differentiated between and identified different man-made and natural products. From here, we will move forward towards page number 96 and you will do question number 6 in your uh, notebooks. Why do we process natural resources before use? We process natural resources to fulfill our needs. Okay, my dear students, now you will do that question in your notebooks. And you will now do the worksheet which will be provided to you by your teacher. So here you, you will first write your name and your class and write under the correct category. Here you can see different materials and you have to write them under man-made and natural. Whether they are man-made or natural. So soil. Soil is man-made or natural? Soil. Then water. Water is natural or man-made? Natural. And let me write one pencil. Pencil is man-made. So this is how you will do rest of the worksheet. It's so easy. Carefully look at the names and then categorize them. From here we will move forward towards your evaluation. So page number 94, I will ask the questions. What Question number 15, what are man-made resources? Anything which is made by man, it is a man-made resource. Question number 16, name some man-made resources. Quickly, biscuits, sugar and bread. These are all sweaters, clothes that you are wearing. These are all man-made. From here, we will move forward towards your homework. So quickly note down the homework. It is given on page number 90, home activity number 4. Write the ways we depend on natural resources. Aapko apni notebook ke andar different ways likhne hai, jin pe hum, jin ki wajay se hum natural resource pe, resources pe depend karte hai. For example, sun pe, water pe, air pe, land pe. We have discussed this in detail in previous lessons. So now you can easily write it down. Then your next homework is home activity number five. Search about some other products which we get from wheat, plants and wood and cotton crops. Note down your answer in your notebook. Now in your notebook, we have learned some things here. We make wheat se biscuits, banate hai, bread. So you have to write some other things that we have to write from natural products. Se 
बनाते हैं ओके फॉर एग्जाम्पल लेट मी टेल यू फ्रॉम वीट वी मेक रोटी दैट यू ईट एवरी डे सो दैट इज मेड फ्रॉम द वीट सो यू हैव टू सर्च आउट सम अदर मैन मेड प्रोडक्ट्स विच वी मेक फ्रॉम दीज नेचुरल प्रोडक्ट्स From here we will move forward towards your wrap up so today's wrap up is people process natural resources to make different products to fulfill their needs hum natural resources ko process karte hain unko different techniques se change karte hain taki hum apni zaruriyat ko pura kar sake so my dear students this is it for today i hope you have learned about the difference between man made and natural things so uh, thank you so much allah hafiz